Yeah, this is how I'm waking up. But let me pose a question to you today that I'm thinking about. What is Misha thinking about today? You guys are going to start asking that pretty soon as I put out these videos. What am I thinking about? How are you showing up in your life today? So I'm thinking, how am I going to show up in my life today? After I get dressed, how am I going to show up in this life? All right. Sometimes we have to tackle the mundane, what it feels like the mundane. And life can seem repetitive, the things that we have to do every day. And as I tell my son sometimes when he goes to work, you may not like the particular job. And until you find that particular job that you like or what you are burning in the inside, your desires, whatever you are being called to do, you can find a way to make your job fun. I told him the same thing when he was in high school. You can find a way to enjoy being in school, that traditional school that's mundane, that sucks sometimes, feels like it sucks. You can find a way to make it different. You have to be creative. That's what this channel is about, living creatively here. So I want you guys to join it. But back on topic, how are you going to show up in your life? How are you going to show up to that job? Maybe that job that you hate. You're going to have to reframe it on the way that you are thinking about it. Are you going to show up with love? Are you going to show up with compassion? Are you going to show up knowing that what you are doing today is going to make a difference in someone's life? Because when you reframe things like that, then you show up better, more effectively in life. You have to change how you see things. You have to change the meaning of things. If you're going to live here in America, I listen to all the people that are moving abroad and some that cannot. How are you going to show up here while you are living somewhere where you think that you do not want to live or that it no longer serves you and you cannot leave yet or whatever? A location, a lover. You have to decide how you are going to see it, how you view it. Are you going to show up? with compassion? Are you going to show up with forgiveness? Are you going to show up for love, for yourself, for others? How are you going to make it fun? How are you going to view it? That's going to make all the difference in your world. You can see living here in America or being with a lover that you think that's no longer serving you, whatever it is. You can see it as progress you can see it that you can see it optimistically that we <clears throat> in America are going to move forward like we have always had even if it's slow progress even if it's slow progress we are going to move forward that you know change has to be made eventually it starts somewhere and with someone is it going to be you are you going to see your sucky marriage or relationship or life? Are you going to tell a story of it being a detriment to your health, to your lifestyle, to your living? Or are you going to tell a story to yourself that you're going to see it as empowerment, as progress, as moving forward, as love, as a better day? How are you going to see your life? How are you going to show up for yourself? That is the question. I have to go to the grocery store today. I am not enjoying that anymore as my children are adults. I do not enjoy just feeding myself on a day-to-day -day basis. I should see it 
as nutrition. I should see it as feeding myself some good food uh, for my living. That's how I should see it. But I don't always see it that way. Okay? I've been having some health challenges. And it has been driving me crazy. But I know I have to see it a different way. And I have to tell myself a different story. So that's what I ask you guys today. How are you going to show up for yourself? So how I'm going to show up. Going to the supermarket. I may even go to the farmer's market. I'm going to show up and say that I am going to find myself some nutritionist food. And that I am going to give love with my money paying to the farmers for this organic food because it's a family-owned business. People put love in it growing the food and I am going to put love in it showing up and giving them money monetarily to get that food. I know what it took to get the food to me. It took a lot of love. It took a lot of sweat, a lot of hard work. I can see it that way and that I'm going to put that vibration into my body. How are you going to show up in your life today, guys? I don't want to scare you, but I just, I just had this thought as I was waking up today and I do not want to look like a scarecrow to you guys, but I did not want to walk away and forget to do the video. But I want you guys to show up in your lives. With love, with happiness, with joy, even in the mundane, even in that boring day-to-day -day situation. Decide for yourself how you would do that. I love you guys. I'll see you in a future video. Become a subscriber. You know what to do. You gotta like the video. So hopefully it will spread to others so we can get this channel going, okay? And then I can have you as my community. I'll start coming on live. We can have nice chats. But we got to do what we got to do and work together. I love you so much.